I think this is Meme Master. I feel fairly certain this is Meme Master. Oh, Melty Blood be streamed on ESPN2. <laughs> Maybe we can try for ESPN7. <laughs> That's the dream. Get zero frames of input. <laughs> Fucking savage. Oh, uh, I need to figure out a way to add names. Fuck. Someone should tell me if anybody can actually point me in the direction of a good way to. Make a simple template for putting player names onto the stream, I would appreciate it. Because if anybody goes to look at this archived, all like one of the people who will, it'll be really hard to tell who's playing. Because I haven't been cutting and restarting the stream. Of course, the hope is that the people who are playing will be able to look at this and use it sort of like replays, but... Actually, I'll start looking them up on Google. Um, Oh, 
Do I should reach out for the archiver for myself? Um. <clears throat> Honestly, it's just something I do without thinking about it. Besides, this is a 4-3 game, there would be a ton of empty space without the chat, right? It's at least useful for the archive. Hmm, that's interesting. Who, in the name of God, would stream Melty in 16-9? Like, seriously, who would stream Melty in 16-9? How could you stream Melty in 16-9? That's a better question. Hey there, guys. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a fighting game scoreboard in OBS. By the end of this video, you could have something that looks similar to this. Okay, let's get this off. Make sure to go to this page on OBS Forum. Make sure to program forward edit and click download now. Then you have a zip file. Just extract it wherever you want. And make a new folder. Title this folder whatever you want. This is where you want to store everything. So I'm just going to type the scoreboard and just put the file in there. Now we are going to open the file and open scoreboard edit. There is an XML method, but I'm not going to be teaching that in this video. Just go ahead and click folder path, and over here you'll see some ellipses. Click that, and browse through the folder. People do play Melty. Melty is actually easier to find not just for than a lot of games. Surprisingly. At the very least, Melty has the gift of not having shit in that play. So... Mad Scientist was a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful man that we all owe a lifetime of debt to. For enabling us to actually play this game. 1k? No. Um. There might be. I don't know. Um. I couldn't actually give you an estimate off the top of my head. I really can't. Um, I can tell you, I might be able to tell you how many people are sitting in the Discord, but not everybody who's sitting in the Discord is playing. Um, like, there are 135 people in an A labeled as North America in the Discord. Um, not all of them play. That being said, um, that doesn't include everybody who could possibly play in NA. Um, there are people who aren't in the Discord. And it's also worth saying that not everybody in the Discord plays all the time. In fact, more people probably sit in the Discord and don't play than do. 
but I've probably had matches with 15 to 20 people in here. Um. For me, all that matters is whether or not I can get a match when I put down my IP. Which I actually can. Um...